Hello, this is David Nutt. I'm chair of Drug Science. And I want to welcome you to our Ask David Anything series of questions. Gregor from Edinburgh asks, I like to use weed on occasions, but I'm worried about how strong it is in the UK. I'm just wanting to have a good time, not get so fried I accidentally eat my toaster. Is there a way for me to test how strong my weed is at home? And sadly, Gregor, that's one of the problems we have at present. There are no testing facilities for, for cannabis. Everyone then is at the risk of, uh, of using substances, using products which are potentially too strong for them or don't have the right balance of the ingredients that we think help produce a more uh, tolerated effect, which is cannabidiol plus THC. Of course, the origins of this problem lie in prohibition and the fact that uh, this country has actually been extremely effective at reducing the importation of traditional herbal or resin cannabis from overseas countries. So now we rely a lot on either imported strong cannabis skunk uh, with high THC concentration or homegrown, which also has very high concentrations of THC. And that process of overgrowing the THC means that the plant itself can no longer produce, it doesn't have the energy resources to produce the cannabidiol. A lot of evidence now that very strong THC is more problematic in terms of dependence, in terms of producing psychotic experiences, and also in terms of generally impairing cognitive function. So it would be great if you could be able to test it yourself, but there is no way of doing that. On the streets now and across Britain, the latest survey suggests that over 95% of what's being sold is skunk, you know, THC over 12% concentration. Ways out of this thing? Well, obviously you can go to places that have rational policies that you can buy different concentrations. You can easily get that in the coffee shops in the Netherlands or in the cannabis uh, pharmacies in the States. But there is the risk, of, you run the risk of being apprehended if you bring it back. You can also grow your own. It's perfectly possible to grow balanced mixtures yourself if you want to. Those things are obviously you know, beyond some people. Uh, the other possibility, and well, perhaps the best way forward, is to join a cannabis growing club, talk to people who are using cannabis, and eventually find someone that is either growing or importing the right kind of cannabis that you, uh, you would like, and then stick with them. If you like my answer, please leave a review and a rating on your podcast app. For tickets for our live podcast on psychedelics on the evening of the 13th of November in London, go to the drugscience.org.uk website. You'll also find a lot of very useful information there. And of course, you can tweet me at ProfDavidNutt or hashtag AskDavidAnything to get your questions answered.